I decided to do a quick video of the Windows Xbox Mixed Reality headset. Um, so for those of you who don't know what it is, pretty much it's Microsoft's version of VR and the future of computing. And as you can see, I mean, it's 3D world of a desktop. So basic things is as you see right here. You know, and as you see, I'm linking up. You have Skype. You have Edge. You know? Um, and I could even, as you see, I'm walking around this. You have maps if you want to do Google search. Uh, Bing. There's your keyboard. Um, you know, let me see. You have the weather. Hmm. So again, this it's pretty amazing to me for the simple fact that you could actually do this while even sitting down. So I could really see within the next 10 years this being an old home office. Um, traveling, I mean, there, there's really a lot of things that you could do. Um, also, it is connected to a Cortana, as you see. I'll just walk right up through it. And there you go. Here's the weather, right? Now you can adjust you know, everything, whatever size you want. Again, I can walk up to this. But, uh, what I want to do is actually not that big. I'll put it here. Move it up. I'll put it right there. Boom. Now the map one, because we do have VR apps for this as well. Um, we can actually get street view. But what I'm actually just again doing right now is pretty much just a quick overview, um, just to give you folks an idea, um, because it's not. Again, a thing just for gaming. So I can't stress that enough. So, you get gadgets like this. And when you're familiar with HoloLens, that's where a lot of the development of this came from, is HoloLens. And this is running off a, a GTX 1050 graphic card. So not too crazy, but enough to actually uh, handle some VR games. You can stream in Xbox. Um, it's enough to get up to the eye, as you see. Um, now, as you see, this white border, that is the boundary that is set up. So these are recordings of people, so you can see what I'm getting at. This could be, you could end up doing a recording of it yourself if it's growing up and in the future you don't have it. You'll actually be able to immerse with a you are literally with them. And I will be doing more videos talking about the future of a lot of this technology. I really hope that um, the youth gets involved in this because there's a lot, a lot, a lot of opportunity available um, you know for so much possibilities. I mean, anything that is available now in 2D, you pretty much got to bring into a 3D realm, whether I'm on office or on the second, but you literally want to, you know, you know, get creative and you want to draw something and, you know, literally draw them and as you see, be able to bring them to life right in front of you. Um, so, I really can't stress that enough. Um, as I keep saying, this is almost like Disney being brought for a home um, to a consumer level. So, um, I'm going to pretty much just cut it short because I actually gotta got to get going. Um, but please feel free to follow, subscribe, comment, ask questions. I will be uploading some video of Halo um, Recruit, which is a demo. Uh, this does play Steam. Um, and I'll even just go over, really good.